Hey, how's it going? A student of mine asked me, or she had a problem when she was working on her essay, and she didn't know how to apply the trick about five space indentation in Google Docs. And to me, that was a challenge. I'm like, oh, I'm going to figure that one out. So I figured it out. <laughs> so I'm going to show you tonight, I'm going to show you in, this is pages. I'm going to show you first in Google Docs and then how to do it in the pages. And then also down here, I have open office. So I'm going to show you that for open office. It's a little bit different in each one, but in Google and Pages, it's actually, I think, easier than it is in Microsoft Word and in OpenOffice. That's what it is. And then I will also provide a link to OpenOffice if you want to get OpenOffice because that's a free uh, productivity suite and it's, it's similar to Microsoft Word. It does take a little bit of getting used to, but, you know, once you kind of experiment with all the the tools and stuff and features, then you can, you know, you can type an essay or make a list or do whatever it is you want to do, just like in a Word document. But it's free. It's open, open source. You know, it's 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 great. Some of my students use Open Office, and you can open up Word documents in Open Office. Okay, and you can open up Open Office documents in Word. That's great, right? Okay, let's do it. Okay, this is Google. And what you do is you go to Format, Align and Indent, Indentation Options. You click on that and you leave these zero. And you go here to First Line under Special Indent. Click on First Line and then you see the 0 0.5. Now, my students, uh, one of the rules that my students have to follow when they write their essays is they have to indent the first line of each paragraph five spaces. So it's a, it's a quarter of an inch, I guess, or it's 0 0.25. So you just put the little cursor right here between the decimal point and the five and you type two and then hit apply I don't know why I do this but maybe I think it's gonna do something else but I always put the cursor behind that just in case something funky happens or doesn't happen by doing that apply and then it is in and you see this little thing here first line indent so I'm gonna write see a lag in my computer. Sally sells seashells down by the seashore. Why am I typing this? The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Did you know that that sentence uses every letter in the alphabet? That's cool, right? Okay, I'm gonna do this. I want to create a paragraph. This control C copy. Okay, so this is about the size <laughs> of an introductory paragraph that my students have to write three to four sentences. Okay, so I'm gonna click enter and it goes right there to that five space indentation. That's even better than Word. In Word, it goes back to the beginning and you just have to hit the tab key to advance it. Isn't that, that's pretty cool. For our body paragraphs, you should write much more than four sentences. Right there, back to the five space. That's pretty neat. Okay, so that's Google Docs. Okay, and here in Pages, now I don't have a Mac, but I do have iCloud, an iCloud account, and I have an iPhone and an iPad. So I was able to bring up, I had to bring this up to open up somebody's document. 
uh, pages file, rather, and I thought, now, in here, how can I change that? So when I open up a document here in pages, it shows this right away, text, and I, I was just kind of looking, I was, you know, I was even clicking here and I couldn't find anything, and I thought, wonder where it is, and then I saw down here, indents. And so this one, I click first indent. So when I hover over it, set the amount of space between the first line of the paragraph and the left margin. Hmm. The first up arrow click is 0 0.25 inches. And it's set. Now with this one, let's see if I can do it. Oh yeah, I can. <laughs> Universal copy paste. Okay, so when I go here, there it is again. Five spaces. Okay, in Open Office, let's see if I can remember this because I found these later, or later, <laughs> earlier today, and I've been doing a whole mess of stuff between then and now. With this one, you click on Format, and oh, maybe Paragraph. Okay, and this one you click on Format, Paragraph, and it shows tabs here, right? Click that so that it only highlights those two. It's 25, so it reads 0 0.25 inches there. Okay, left, okay, hit OK. And when you hit the Tab key on the keyboard, it, it goes in just those five spaces. But when you, now you have to do it just like Word. Let's do it. Sally sells seashells. I think I wrote too many for my introductory paragraph. If you're writing longer papers, your your introductory paragraphs will have more sentences. Okay. When I go here and hit the enter key, I have to hit the tab key to go in five spaces, but it automatically goes in five spaces. Okay, what kind of day would you like to have? Please comment, like, share, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. And have a, or an, a perspicacious day. Perfect. And a perfect day. Well, no, it's hard to be perfect. Bye.